Hello everyone, this is Pastor Miguel from the Children's Bread Deliverance Ministry Church here in Maryland. Today I want to talk to you about uh, Deliverance Ministry. What is Deliverance Ministry? Uh, a lot of Christians out there don't really know what Deliverance Ministry is. And uh, there's a lot of people who are curious about what Deliverance Ministry is. And Deliverance Ministry has a bad rap because of things that people have done in the past. Uh, but uh, I just want to tell you and explain to you what Deliverance Ministry is so that you have a good understanding of what the ministry is and how it could help you. So deliverance ministry is the process of liberating someone from demons, okay? And so a lot of people, when they think of deliverance ministry, the first thing they think is casting out a demon or an exorcism, right? But deliverance ministry, there's more to deliverance ministry, the process of liberating someone that um, that that is part of deliverance ministry. Obviously, the most important part is the actual casting out of, of demons, uh, which is what most people think when they think of deliverance ministry, and that is commanding the demons to come out of a person in the name of Jesus Christ. That's number one. Number two is what we call inner healing. And inner healing is uh, the healing of emotional wounds that a person may have because of abuse, rape, uh, any type of uh, trauma that they suffered. And so deep wounds, inner, uh, uh, deep wounds, emotional wounds, those are things that will need uh, inner healing and that's part of the deliverance ministry and obviously Jesus Christ does the uh, the healing uh, because he came to heal the brokenhearted and so Jesus Christ is the healer he's the deliverer the the third uh, step to deliverance ministry and not everybody needs all these steps but they're part of what we call deliverance ministry it's obviously counseling uh, you know, Christian counseling is very important where the person who is free or the person be before they even get married should go through counseling and deliverance. So, you know, Christian counseling helps the person even after they get delivered to guide the person because unfortunately their life has been manipulated and controlled by these demons. And so they have a misunderstanding of what right and wrong is. So it's good to have a good Christian counseling that could a counselor that could help the person make obviously good decisions and when they have questions about whether they're sinning or not that uh counselor is there for them to help them determine why it's a sin and why they should go ahead and stop sinning okay so a, a good christian counseling is definitely part of what we call the deliverance ministry and these things are all part of our ministry they're part of our ministry and it's to help people that their minds get free uh you know their ability to make good decisions get better and they don't have the hindrance of these demonic beings that are preventing a person from living the, the life that God has meant them to, to, to live, okay? So the deliverance ministry is just a process, just a process of setting someone free. And obviously it includes the mind, uh, the will, the emotions of a person. And, um, you know, so it's important part to make sure that the deliverance minister or the deliverance ministry that you go see understands that the you know deliverance is just not casting demons out of people it's obviously other things have to be dealt with right and there's a mental uh mental health aspect of deliverance ministry and uh, which our ministry works with that as well so if you like to receive ministry you could go to our website it's www.pastormiguel.com and you could sign up for ministry there and we'll be happy to help you thank you so much for watching this video please share with others let them know what deliverance ministry is and get them the help they need. God bless you guys. Take care. Bye-bye.